And what kind of complications can we expect from this kind of a buildup that we see? So that's a very interesting question. And even though I'm, I'm summarizing this in literally 10 seconds, uh, this is a huge field of study and people have focused their careers uh, understanding each step that is involved in, in the development of ather atherosclerotic plaques. But I think that for, for the viewers, there's two main things that, that can happen when cholesterol accumulates in the artery wall. The first one is that it accumulates and it grows and grows and grows until it obstructs blood flow, like a pipe that's blocked. Um, but the second and perhaps more dangerous scenario is that the plaque starts growing and then it breaks, it ruptures. And when it ruptures, a blood clot forms very quickly and very quickly obstructs blood flow. And that's generally what happens when you have a heart attack. Wow, and how long can it take for somebody to have a buildup of this kind of accumulation? Are we talking months, years? Give us an idea if that, you can. That's a great question and it's something that we're still researching. But I think that the answer is really, it's a, it's a relatively slow process that happens in the scale of years, not months, not weeks.